really cool and really respectable. Um, whereas, like, the whole Sagittarius thing is just, like, scattered, like, inconsistency. Like, I think it's really cool to be a Taurus. I think it's really respectable. This job really... I need to get more Tylenol or something. You would go viral on TikTok. My cousin just kind of went viral. Did, did you guys see Connor's video? He has, like, 100k views on it. It's pretty cool. Speaking Spanish. Um, what do you want me to say? I, I, I can try to translate. So I can read Spanish really well. Why did IRL break up? Okay. I'm going to answer this one time. Okay. So everybody start your screen recordings now. So I don't have to answer it anymore. Okay. I didn't mean that in a sassy way. I'm just saying. Basically, we kind of had a moment where we all went into the studio. And I had to set up the whole studio, right? I spent like 40 minutes setting this up. Um, and it was like kind of crazy. Like I had to patch all this stuff. It took a long ass time. And um, we were all sitting down. We are waiting for Drew. And Drew comes. All of us sit down. Start talking. Serge is like, hey guys, like what's your guys' feelings on the band? And um, apparently they had talked about it the night before. So I didn't even know that this was going to happen. So they, had, they talked about it. And, and they were like, hey... Like, what are you guys' thoughts on the band right now? And I was like, I'm not enjoying myself. Like, I think I'm not really enjoying a lot of the stuff we do. And I think that I'd be much happier if I was making music on my own. And if we could. And I think that all of us are much better individually. And I think that um, it's not fun anymore. And that's basically what happened. Like, all of us kind of agreed. We're all like, yeah, like, it hasn't been fun for a long time. And I was like, yeah. Um, and that's not because the guys, like, you know, obviously there's some things where we didn't get along, but like, like we all, we obviously do get along quite well, but um, there's like, like, there's just like s some times when we didn't, you know, and it was mostly the people around us that it was like, they were just like so bad at their jobs that it made it not fun. Um, so that's, that's what happened. Like all of us went around in a circle and we we're talking about it. And I started, I was like, I'm not enjoying myself. And it's not it's not Hollywood Records fault. It's the whole it was a lot of stuff. When it stopped being fun a long time ago. A long time ago. Um, it was not fun. Cause like I don't know if you guys hear, hear the music that I make, but it's completely different. You know? Like that's just like not what I enjoy doing. Um it's especially when especially when so much is just constantly going wrong. Like every show we had there's mistakes. Every show we had there's something going wrong. Um, so, you know, like, like even tours, it was like, damn, like, I can't believe I have to perform this stuff. Like, I was like, damn it, like, I have to get through this tour, you know? So that's what it was, to be completely honest. Like, that's what it was. I was like, I'm just not enjoying this. That's just me, though. You know, I can't speak for the other guys. And you didn't... Yeah, I'm not, not really into that, but... Was it ever fun? There is obviously there was parts that were fun, for sure. Like there was like we had such a good time together. That was one of the main reasons why we broke up, because we had such a good time together. Like we all were really good friends, so close. And as the 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 business was happening, as the management was was doing crazy things, and like everything was just like really messed up. Like there's everything just went wrong. We stopped being friends as much. Was there anyone who didn't want the band to break up? Yes, there was. Um, there's two people. So that was crazy. It was like... Me... Yeah, I'm not going to say it, but yeah. It was crazy. But you guys did what you guys was best. Yeah, it was awesome. I mean, it, it helps. Like, I'm I'm so much better now. Like, I, I feel like I'm so much happier. Like, I'm just doing literally exactly what I want to do. You know? So anyway, that's the... That's the tr true, honest answer. You don't have to be sorry. I'm. So, I mean, like I learned so much. It was awesome. Such a good time. Um, we had so much fun with the fans. The fans are so much fun, and I still have you guys in my life, which is sick. But it was not for me, and I'm so glad that I'm able to make the music I want to make. You know.
if you, what, what if y'all happen to do more R&B stuff? Well, that was one of the problems, you know? It's like, there was some people in the group that loved what we were doing. Loved our music. You know? And I was not one of those people. Would you guys ever do a reunion tour? No, I would not do that. If you start crying, I'm not, no, I'm not, like, sad about it. I just wanted to answer your question. I'm definitely not sad about it. I was one of the people that was, um, like, spearheading it. I can probably find a throw it back to an original B-Tut song. Would you ever go back to public school? Absolutely not. I'm so glad we flew around to that tour, though. It was so fun. I'm so glad you guys came. We had so much fun. We had so much fun, guys. Ow. 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 Yeah. That's pretty much it. Everything happens for a reason. No more looking back. Only forward. Exactly. And that's not to say it wasn't, you know, that's, that's not to say that it wasn't good times, you know? There was good times. But it, but overall, not for me, you know? What about these Spanish songs? Again. I'm glad you're doing what makes you happy. What happened to your arm, dude? Um, I'm, I, 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 I didn't know that I hadn't told you guys about, like, what actually happened. So I'm glad that you guys are hearing this for the first time. Um, it was pretty crazy. It was wild, though. Like, I didn't even know the conversation was going to happen until I got there. It was crazy. You remind me of this kid I went to Japan with. It's nice to finally have an explanation, but damn, that shit hurt it. I'm sorry. What's your favorite memory from IRL? Um, we, our first, our first tour was so fun. Um, it was so fun. It was, like, such a good time. And then after that, it started getting... Everything started getting screwed up. But our first tour, where we were just opening up for American Idol, we didn't have to do anything. <laughs> it was so fun. And then we just, like, were boys. Like, we were just hanging out, like, having fun. It was awesome. I can't wait for your solo tour when we fly out and turn up to get trashed again. I'm super excited about that. I, I want to open up for someone next year. I think that'd be awesome. I'm glad you voiced your opinion and didn't hold back. Yeah, it was crazy. Like, we were all sitting down, and we were, like, we were all genuinely wondering how each other felt about it, you know? I'm excited for Sergio's solo music. Dude, me too. I, he just sent me a file of his music, and it was awesome. Go lay down, Brady. Yeah, yeah I'm really hurting a lot, actually. <laughs> but it's okay. Open up for Demi Lovato. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Open up for pretty much. That'd be crazy, too. I really like Pretty Much his music. I think they're really good. It's good that you guys are close enough to be 100% honest with each other. Yeah, I mean, that, that's what it is, you know? And there was people crying and stuff. Like, it was pretty intense. Like, it was an intense situation. It was, like, three guys that were like, hey, like, we don't want to do this anymore. And the other two were like, what? Like, it was crazy. It was, like, a shock to them. You know? But it was necessary. Opening up for PM would be dope. Yeah. Did they use tune boxes? I don't know, shouldn't get into that. Patiently waiting for Kawami. Yeah, that's a good song, dude. Do you still see Camry? Yeah, I, I invited him to a party the other day. And he came through. It was fun. I love you so much. I love you, too. Chance and yeah. But also good you three don't feel trapped in a way. Yeah. You know? No feelings were hurt. Like we're all like homies, you know? You know? It's tough. Do you still talk to John? John Club? Um, every once in a while. Not often. Are you still managed by WEG? I'm not. Oh, well, it's actually crazy. I have to have that. I still haven't had that conversation. Like, I haven't really talked to them at all since the band ended. <laughs> I've just been making music. Don't open. Let's just go on tour together. Bro, hell yes. Let's do it. I'm so down. Let's do it, bro. When? My arm's got to heal up a little bit, bro. But after, let's do it. Yeah. Can you text Jack and give me an order? 
I'm I'm on I'm on like a live stream thing. Oh, okay. I'll do it. Thanks, Mama. Sure. Summer tour. Dude, bet. Let's do it. I'm down. Let's do it. Um I'll talk to the peeps. I I have to get some songs done. And then we'll do it. Yes, Brady and Gunner tour. Dude, this kid Gunner, just saying, has some pretty ridiculous music on the way. I have listened to some because um he works with Ryan as as some of y'all know. Pretty ridiculous stuff. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be a big, big, big year for Gunner. I can tell you that right now. Bro, make sure you come to Milwaukee so I can come see you. Um, Alright, I'm in Milwaukee right now. Open up for Why Don't We? That'd be sick. Crazy talks. Crazy, crazy talks. Summer tour with some 2K in debt. That's tough, man. Not in a company is excellent. Thanks, I appreciate that. Hell yeah. I've listened to For Your Love over 25 hours. That's exactly how you should be doing it. Big year for Brady Sutton. I'm hype on it. It's going to be a fun year. It's going to be a good time. Get well soon. Sergio, buddy, what's up? How you doing, man? I was just telling them how um, you sent me your music, and it's crazy. We're meeting up in, with Ben in London next week. We fly. Oh, that's so fun. I have to get back in touch with Benny. I haven't talked to him in a bit. Personally, soft Dior is better than Dior. Okay, I agree. Um, I made a ver- I'm still working on that song. But I'm waiting. Um, there's these two producers that Ryan knows that I'm trying to do Dior with. So I'm waiting to do it with that. Um, because I wanted to have, like... I'm just not, like, that amazing at producing it. You know? I've been learning, but... Um, I'm not, like, on a level, when I know that chorus is so good, like, I think that chorus is so good that I want, um, that I, I want to do it with, like, good, pro- good producers that are going to make a track that I'm going to really like, you know, if that makes sense. I just really want it to be awesome, and I don't think that my production capabilities are there yet. Popstar and Drake. Wow, that's crazy. You guys know my songs that haven't come out yet. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm like, I'm not, I don't know which ones are worth putting... T- it's really hard for me to go back and work on old songs. And I know it's not that old, but... Um, like, it's really hard for me to go and work on anything that I, that I did not on the day of. Like, if I write something and I don't um, have the second verse done that day, like, it, a lot of times it just won't happen. Hey, Lofton, what's up, man? Um, I, I miss you, buddy. I haven't seen you in a long time. My dude had surgery yesterday. I did have surgery yesterday. It was tough, man. Dude, they, like, went ham on me. Like, I swear, it hurts way more than it did when I broke it. Like, I don't know what they did in there, but I got hella screws. This man just went crazy on me. Where's the London girl? So, that's a good sign. I'm going to hop out, but hopefully I'll see you soon. Okay, Aaron, I'll see you soon. I'm, I think my, my lighting got kind of bad. Should I get my computer, maybe? So what happened to his elbow? Thoughts on New Hope Club? I think New Hope Club is sick. Um, I really like that song, Crazy. Go ahead and... Well, when are you releasing Stranded? Oh, I redid the drums for Stranded. Um... Ow, ow, my arm. Ow, ow, ow. Um, I redid the drums. So I think they sound, like, really cool now. I'm really excited about it. Ow. Ow. Um, yeah, I think it sounds really cool. It's a little more trappy now, but I was kind of bored with it. So, I can always go back to the other drums because I have an alternate saved. But I think it sounds really cool. Um, let's see if you guys like it. Man's be struggling. Sir, stop moving around. I know, it hurts so bad. Uh. Sure, should, I, should I plug it into the speaker, maybe? Here. Come with me. 
Joke's on you. You don't have a choice. Okay, we're scooting. Um. Mm. Okay. Wait. I gotta get my eye lock. It's not gonna work. That's what you made me go crazy too. Go ahead and tell me you're crazy. That's what you made me. You're crazy too. Mm -hmm. I think the new Justin Bieber album is cool. Um, I think that it sounds like... I was talking about this with my sister and older brother. It sounds like they got, like, a dictionary and just kind of, like, chose a bunch of random super big words and threw them in there for no reason. The melodies are amazing. The lyrics are just, like... Like, why? I just don't understand. I really don't get it. Um, I really don't understand it. Okay. I'm gonna try to um, find my chords so you guys can hear this. You're crazy too. Okay. Let's see you guys like it. Oh. Let's see if it's good. Wait, let me fix something really quick. I said I'm going. Cool. 